Yeah, Feels like these races ready. are coming my thick and fast down. now. The Princess Elizabeth up to the start line in a skill and Royal Action. Boat Club versus Eton College. Go! That is such a symphony of the start. It's a beautiful to listen to. It really, really is. Silence before the storm. I think I've coined that phrase a couple of times at Enley, but I'm going to reuse it every single year now. It's great to watch. It is incredible. One of my friends, who's not a rower, is here at the moment, and she went out in a launch and followed a PE race yesterday and came in, and she said, what a buzz. She said it was just extraordinary. She couldn't believe the speed that the launch had to take off at just to keep up with these eights. They are extraordinary boats, and we're seeing... A little bit of a masterclass here in the early stages. Eaton now with just breaking into clear water over Enniskillen. Masterclass is the word for it. So this Eaton crew are, the superlatives run dry, to be totally honest. They're a phenomenal, phenomenal crew. They won the national schools by almost clear water, which is obviously our English championships. And you can see here, as we pan to live shots, they've established a commanding leader, Enniskillen, who themselves from Ireland, a very accomplished unit, but just no match for the superior power, superior technique, form of Eton, who are looking for their third consecutive Princess Elizabeth Challenge Cup in a row, which would equal the overall record for successive retentions. So what are we thinking for Eton College here? At the regatta, Tom, what's your prediction if you're going to put down put down a guess early? I think Will you know which way I'm going to be heading. Yeah, if William Hill fancy taking stakes on who's going to win the Princess Elizabeth, I think it's uh, my money would be with Eton College. I I've watched them all season. They looked like a unit in transition at the school's head in March. They looked like a unit well down the pathway to transition at the national schools, and now they, they look like a complete outfit. I saw them out paddling on Sunday just really, really well together. They're exceptionally well drilled. They're also huge. We should remind viewers that these guys are all under the age of 18, 18 or under, right? They're schoolboys. And I can tell you now, I did not look like that at 18. I still don't look like that now. So it's amazing how incredibly well conditioned, both physically and psychologically, these guys are. But Eaton just now managing to enjoy themselves as they come into the enclosures. You can be sure as well, Sarah, that there'll be a lot of vehement support for Eton College and hopefully Enniskillen, Enniskillen Royal Boat Club as well from Ireland, who themselves have raced a couple of times in England this year, both the school's head and I think the National Schools Regatta where they finished 10th overall. So again, they, they, were, they were in the top 10 at the Nationals, but you can see here Eton just a class apart. Yeah, that's right. As you said, Enniskillen, they're the top Irish junior aide after beating St. Joseph's Rowing Club at the National Schools. And as you said, Tom, they finished 10th overall in Championship 8s at National Schools. So a class crew, they've made it through to the Wednesday, but unfortunately not able to take it to Eton College, one of the favourites for this event in the Princess Elizabeth Challenge Cup. And one thing I would love to mention about Eton is their phenomenal fundraising efforts for the Ukraine. Obviously, we all are aware of the conflict that's happening in Eastern Europe, and they actually managed to raise over £40,000 earlier this month uh, by, I think, rowing at a certain distance or, or, or sort of doing something together. And it was it was an amazing fundraising effort from those guys. And the whole boat club took part in specially customised all-in-one. So an incredible achievement from those guys. And, and what a season it would be if they can cap it with a win at Henley Royal Regatta, which we all know is the peak and sole aim of their programme. Great display of schoolboy rowing. The Eton College in the front of screen and Enniskillen Royal Boat Club. As the crews come down to the line, we hear the applause from the crowd. Fantastic display here. Thank you. 
As we see, Anna Skillen come across the line there. Was Eton College winning this round of the Princess Elizabeth Challenge Cup over Enniskillen Royal Boat Club?